Uh, okay. So, I am ready. Hello, like you greetings from Phantom, good looking games. Hey, nice! So basically, uh, Phantom sent you guys over to me. Oh, uh, thank you. That was some amazing gameplay, Phantom, okay? I am very impressed. Good job if you are seeing this. And uh, yeah, I bet you made your viewers really proud here, Tia. Good luck in round two as well. Ah, oh, which is probably gonna be versus me if I can perform as well as he did. Wait, I'm gonna be switching up my audio. That means I need to switch up a few things. This and this. Uh, there we go. Mm-hmm. And now we are ready. Oh, yes, I believe I am ready. Uh, ready. Uh, let's go. Uh, okay. Uh, good luck and fun. 130. Uh, nah. Uh, let's, uh, let's play this. Mm-hmm. Green from Phantom. Nice tournament you, you prepared. P.S. Can you teach him English, please? Ah! Uh, dude, he's fine. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, That's nice. Um, okay. So we are playing Bidley here, and we're playing versus Solmir. Um, in this tournament I get to like we get to like enforce like whatever like the bigger rules that we kinda want. And this time we just went for like a very specific matchup that uh the very dear viewer of ours just requested. So yeah, that's what exactly what we're doing. Uh the bunker is actually like really great. I get to collect like pretty much everything here almost immediately. I also get like a speed archer here immediately as well, which is gonna be good for fights. Uh, am I gonna be able to double this? Yes. Um, let's keep. Mmm, gonna be good enough. Tell the free series, won by Underdog. You worried? <laughs> um, that's quite the take. Uh, yeah, I'm kinda worried. Mm hmm. The scattered provides plus two morale. Yeah. Cute creature. Mm hmm. Lepreni, I guess. Uh, the same as Lashab and me, by the way. Yep. That is the case. Okay, so uh sitting goes for the one on one. Uh let's roll the next bunker. Next bunker is gonna be Meta the Sea. I'm not sure if it's even that much better uh than the previous option. Uh thoughts when I'm out of here, so in two turns, if I were to get knowledge, I would be able to TP. Uh wisdom and spell power. I don't know. So I would be getting to collect the two scrolls here, but like, there wouldn't be like much knowledge. Unless like they're literally set up here. Which could be the case, but I'm not sure if I want to risk it. Yeah, let's go for another one. I really would like an ocean to start here. An ocean to start would be making me really fast, and uh or pirate one would be also pretty good. Yes, ocean is. So we're gonna be full ocean the uh, ocean plus cannon gaming here for the early phases. Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, yeah, that's pretty good. I'm gonna be able to go and get this ore, get some, yeah, the rest of it, and that's gonna be nice. So this is gonna be the map that we're playing. Cool, the new town I didn't know very well. Yeah, this is cool. Um, it's introduced by the Hoda, and it's very well crafted by the Hoda team. It has all sorts of, uh, sea creatures. Um... Mm-hmm. By the way, could you share with us the link for the tournament bracket, if possible? Exclamation point tournament. Um, and you can see it exactly. The tournament is gonna be over in a few more days, despite all the sun today. I really wanted like a high-paced tournament where everything is covered. That was my vision for it, and that's exactly what we're doing. Uh, okay. Uh, we see a stronghold side, it's gonna be my biome. Uh, we can see a dungeon middle, so there's gonna be a vortex option, coffee side, and my opponent's biome, though we see nothing of it. Mm-hmm. Uh, now we just have to go back, and, um, how are we doing this? Uh, we can go past, like, uh, probably most of these things. It's only D2 so far. So... Uh, Diplo. And some defense skill, too. So yeah, I just pick up some wood and get out of the bunker on D4. But with all the resources and a pretty good amount of army, and decent stats. I also like the scouting RT here at the very beginning as well. Uh, where's the comic relief? Um, he is dead, Pixton. Uh, is Factory a legend, or will it be released before the apocalypse? Um... Well, it'll be released at some point. 
Whenever that is, I'm just gonna be excited for it. Um, I get to do this, and I get to go for... Ooh. I'll show you it's not so good, so I'm actually pretty happy that I'm skipping this town. Otherwise, it would be pretty hard to uh, buy and build stuff. Resources really, really great. And do I want this knowledge? I guess I probably do. And, mm, yeah, okay. I'll go for this as well. Town is gonna be, like, here... I think... Oh, wait. But now I need the gold pile to buy up the mage. Wait, this might have been a mistake. Yeah, I think I'm actually, like, a little bit too greedy here. Ugh. Yeah, I might be getting punished here by my green. Also, the one stacks is pretty bad. I can get the town, but I cannot get any mana back. Uh, that's pretty bad. Mm, so I may as well not go for the... Well... Mm. <laughs> yeah, I mean, without gold... I guess I can buy a mage guild and trade. Yeah. I think that might be the play for me. Uh, 200, 300, and I can trade up some more. Yeah. It's a painful thing to have to do, uh, but uh, I reap what I sell. And that's all there is to it. Exactly 2k. And yeah, we got a mage guild. Uh, no book yet, of course. Mm, maybe the crewmates are gonna be doable. So that's gonna be like maybe my soda boss, and I can go into the treasury as well. And so on. Mm, yeah. Uh, let's do the pine. I also have the cannon here to help me out, like tank stuff and stuff and such. Uh, this time we're gonna be doing it properly with one stacks. Properly ish. I think I want like four of them moving back, and then by that point the fight should be uh kind of simple. Uh, morale. That means that one of the, one more is coming than I would have liked. I'll be able to like bait those up, and yeah, these guys I just need to crawl down and, and just get that out of the way. This one I think I have to just also kind of ignore for now. Yeah, okay, to hit the cannon. That uh, is the best case scenario here, I think. Hmm. Yeah, may as well just send one of these tags back. And uh, I do not have a wait down here. Yeah, okay. Um, This will do. It's a decent fly. And then we get Man of the Sea here. I can get this. Uh, Treasury is also big. That's amazing for me right now. Mm-hmm. I just want to start properly. Here, here, and here. We'll do. Oh, uh, yeah, let's go. And this is going to be my sounding economy in this treasury. Mm, Could have just placed myself better. Then wouldn't need to worry about this stack, but... uh, It's okay-ish. Uh, the birds are just kind of like along for the Rhine. Mm hmm. Uh, my skill tree is kind of horrible. I guess I'll grab archery, but I'm not gonna be happy with this. I can go for the nest, and I can go for a roost as well. And now I think I have to go for my schools of magic here in the comfy. And that is exactly what I'm gonna be doing. I think I'm just Ding immediately. If I could. Yeah, I don't really understand the world, so maybe I'll just go a little bit. Okay. Now I understand the world a little bit better. Still not enough, though. Oh, uh, this boss is kind of cool, too. Where's the Hero of Your Overlay? Oh, right, I kind of forgot about it. Uh, naturally. Mm-hmm. I mean, Sartre is going to be, like, making for more of a Giga Cannon, so... Yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, uh, what of these? I think it's probably a fine fight. 
And I will just go ahead and take it immediately. I can level up like a few more times without it being detrimental. And the attack skill will also like help out the cannon quite a bit. Mm-hmm. Mm, nice. Mm, this is expected. And then, yeah, I can still level up a bit, so I'll just DD over to the treasure chest here. So I can collect stuff along the way to the comfy. Hmm. Actually, I didn't build a roost. One of the here. So yeah, my Jeremy is really struggling to collect like a decent skill tree. Um, okay. I'm going to be having the top right here. I could get like another bird dwelling. Um, I cannot pick this up in this turn, so yeah, uh, I can't really do much more, so I'm uh, sitting in the Mage Guild, and next time I'm going Earth Air immediately. Uh, that's gonna be like pretty nice. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Such left unprepared in the desert, yeah, I mean, I think that even Phantom didn't expect to reach him there, he was going pretty top and he was like, oh! Opponent? Oh, he's on low army. Ah, I see. You know? I think it was as surprising to him as it was for anyone else. I have a Thunder Helmet in my volume, but it's not even, like, that important to me. Portal Brace, by the way. Now that is a... That is a box. Uh-huh. See, so yeah, next time I immediately start off over here, and then maybe we'll be trying to scout the, those right. I'm going to be getting my Schools of Magic up, and going to be possibly having a decent one. All three towns are going to be like the same as Stygian for at this moment, at the very least. He's only playing, playing pretty fast. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, Magic Puny, Air Earth, uh, yes, let's go. And now we just need to get all these Schools of Magic up, and I'll be in a pretty good spot. And I already see like quite a bit of content here on this side. And the cannon is gonna be destroying it here. I wonder what this boss is. Sharpie is. I don't think I can do that. Mm, yeah. I have to skip the slog up. Ooh, I might not be able to like actually get this in return immediately. Well, I don't I need to either. Oh, uh, log again. But I have to keep skipping it in favor of other things that are going to be like more important, at least immediately. I also have my library here on the side of the map. This is a pack of Sharpies. If I get like this boss worth of army, yeah, I'm just staying out here, I think. Yeah, let's go. These two bosses will lead me to... Yeah, they're being super, super strong. Uh, that's pretty good. That's okay. And now, please don't fight me. Ah. Oh, that's actually a pretty good auto. Yeah, I'll just take that. I also see a big sword, but I'm not sure if I want it yet. Uh, this time I'm pretty sure I'm going for the library already. Hmm. Roost is okay. I don't have a sawmill, but I do have an orphan. And based on the current resources, that's probably like the better distribution. Hmm. This fight is also gonna be. Okay. Um, expert Earth here already. And now I'm picking up the bigger stats here in the library. Uh, nah. 
Hmm, minus 10. Hmm. Not sure how preventable that is, so I'll just take it. Then I'll be probably trying to outpower the Salmi already. Mm hmm. Oh, it's actually looking very fancy. I think I'm just gonna be going for a bunch of marketplaces right now. I already have one because I needed to trade early, I remember. Uh, and yeah, now I have Bless as well. Uh, the Ocean upgrade is good, the Bird upgrade would be good, but I have no resources to do it yet. <clears throat> I think that this is like a Bird Boss almost every single time. So, I think that's where I'm going. Maybe I could just DD North here as well. Pick up the big sword, the treasury. That would also be, like, uh, very amazing for me. Oh, uh, my candle will already be doing work. Archery, artillery, and attack skill. Everything that I need for that. Also, I have, like, a few PDF pieces. Could be interesting. Hmm. Uh, random or Jeremy pick? Neither. It's like a pick game. Uh, somebody picked out the matchup for us, so Jeremy versus Solmir, and we're just playing that matchup. Uh, that someone is just Feral, by the way. Uh, one piece is pretty bold, the sharpshooter. But I'm not sure how much I want that. Maybe TPing over to the, uh, the this place, and then walking out and the Ding here would be even faster. And I would be also able to, like, rally up a bunch of stuff. Yeah, maybe I'll do that. Uh, that way I'd be stronger. I can also go for through the helmet, uh, fly into here, and then continue onwards into this town. Probably through the swordsman box too. And after that, I'm gonna be like pretty close to breaking, I guess. Hello, shop. How would you suggest a new Heroes Three pl player to learn to play dual versus computer? No, I think that if you just like join the lobby, there's gonna be like plenty of people that are gonna be, you know, um, what, uh, kind of newish and um, looking for games. And you can just, like, play anyone. I mean, you can also play against computer if you would like, if you don't feel comfortable, but, uh, yeah. At least the way that I did it is I got crushed, like, hundreds of amounts of times, and then I became, you know, started getting crushed less and less as I went. I already have, like, quite a few, yeah, quite a bit of premise stats here, too. That's why my, yeah, that's why my stats are looking as good as the deal. I have the dreadies over here as well. Anyway, I need to get, like, up to this Expert Air ASAP. So we need to be doing some fights. So yeah, I think I will go like this for now. Then, uh, yeah, this upgrade every time. So that's, like, a decent amount of Oceanids, decent amount of Men of the Sea, and I have some Stormbirds to you, left over. No alerts. Aww. Uh, Michiko, what a good sub. Went over to uh, Nutarani. Thank you. Um, that's easy, and I'm gonna be flying over uh, to the right side here, too. I probably will pick up this uh, treasure chest at the same time. If I lose so much mana here, then it would be kind of troublesome, but I'm not really planning to. Not the strongest turn, but I am getting, like, an insane amount of stats here. And about to get, like, decent army as well. Nice. And about to start, uh, yeah, I'm about to start being able to, like, double dimension door, too. I don't see, like, any other, uh, good content here on the map so far. I would be able to buy, buy out the Lika Tower here, but I would only be revealing, like, this northern part of the map here, basically. Uh, this town that I skipped out on is gonna be the dungeon town, by the way. And dungeon towns are pretty important. And also, Archer is not really that bad. I mean, I don't like having it, but it's at least gonna be good with the Medusa bosses in the middle. And there's gonna be quite a few of those. So yeah. I remember the good old days when people would build Nick stacks. Ah, uh, sometimes that's a thing, but... Right now, I prefer birds and tempo. Yeah, that's a pretty easy fight. And for a real rewarding thing to you. And yes! Exactly as expected, we have the Ace of Box here. And yeah, I'm gonna be going through here as well. Probably leveling up into my... 
I expect air here, like, really soon by this point, I would assume. Mm, wait, this is a very big fight too, I just re realized. What this means is that there's actually ambition here for a very, very good box. Well, not really. Yeah. I could be collecting these dwellings over here. It's all my sword to go to. And we can just chill in Mage Guild. I also want these stockpiles already as well. Anyway, yeah. I have a decent idea of my next turn, and we can just do it. Yeah, I'm definitely using all the control spells here every single turn that I make. Uh, maybe I have the air too. I didn't check. No, I don't. I don't want that bit. Yeah, I don't want that helmet there, actually. I think I'm breaking on the next turn. Yeah, I'm definitely breaking on the next turn. Log here. Nice. And I get to pick up this box as well. Or the stockpile. I think I prefer the box. Flee. Hmm, they don't flee. Oh, uh, that's gonna be like a little bit painful. Mm, that's fine. Ah, uh, that's fine. And, uh, we gotta put out box here, too. Uh, we can go for the nest upgrade, um... Yeah, and rally all of this up. And this is good enough. I could, like, go for, like, another turn here, but I think that would be a little bit wasteful in terms of my time. Uh, yeah. Um, okay, so he has, uh, pretty good stats here as well, just like me. I don't know how many towns he has or anything like that, though. So some things are still... Um, sure. Mm, at least one bird, one stack. These, this one stack. And I think we're kind of good to go. Ooh, on Blast I almost one shot. Cannon is dealing some damage. Not sure how much I want to hit there. Eh, maybe. Please don't curse me. Yeah, this is pretty. Oh, uh, that double hit was pretty nasty, though. Ah, that double damage too. Ooh, that's actually some... Uh, yeah, that's actually another 3 piece too. Mm, but I don't know. Maybe not yet. Ooh, gonna copy him. Yeah, I think I'll take this. It's uh, pretty easy and very rewarding. So, let's see a reason why not. <laughs> Rip on me. Yep. Wow, I could try here from the cannon, does a lot of damage. Oh, uh, nice bit logger here too. Ooh. 
Oh, uh, gonna be decent. This is gonna be like the first of my Medusa boxes. Ah, uh, good stuff. And I am red here, so I will be having like some priority. Uh, just because of that alone. I'm double building the roost. Um, yeah. Oh, I didn't equip the copium. Ah. Uh, the more birds I have, the less bleeding I will do in general, is my take here. So I'm going to be having, like, all the birds that I can. Oh, that's actually a one-shot here. I have archery, so I do want to be collecting these uh, Medusa bosses quite a bit. Uh, that's a pretty easy one, all things considered. Gone for 25 medusers, and I guess I'll pick this up to you. It's pretty good with the cannon, and then yeah, we're just pushing middle. Oh, uh, that's a big box. Um, anyway, I need my uh, two setup here already as well. I don't have my middle, I mean, I don't have my biome uh, dungeon down here to build into either, though. I should be middle first. Uh, though I don't know. He does have more towns than I do. So that could be dangerous for me. Mm, wait, maybe I should like back off. Or am I like being super aggro? I'm not sure if I am. Uh, I could be farming up like the box, the necklace here next turn. And these would be like very good objectives as well. Then eventually I would just come over to him and hit him very hard. Though, without scouting, it would be definitely be, uh, yeah, still pretty hard as well. Yes, you'll have to pick up the second best sword in the game. Situationally even best. Well, but like, not really here. 26 attack is awesome though. And if I get middle control against like a soul mirror, when I have like artillery and stuff, that would be also like pretty pretty good. If I had the air, would you, I would be able to like judge way better on what I should do. But without the air, it's gonna be hard to make these decisions. Uh, I could be going for PDF. Wait, let me see my PDF progress. I currently have two pieces on me. Uh, this would be three, four, five. Yeah, so five pieces for the PDF already like uh, in sight. If I look over here, there's nothing. If I look over here, there's nothing. Mm hmm. I don't feel like there's a chance without army coaching. Uh huh. I've never seen you back up before. This is gonna be a first. <laughs> Interesting. Uh, where's my buy Utopia? I don't see it anywhere here. So I guess it's gonna be like to the right. Yeah. I still need my airtom and such. Yeah, he's getting like some insane stats here. Another big box. Wow. Wait, but do I want this necklace? I mean, I do. I'm just not really sure if it's a good thing to go for. Wow. Yeah, I feel an insane amount of damage. Oh, uh, water will deal. It's kind of would, would have been preferred. Hmm. Yeah, this is going to be rough. But, like, I need these. Yeah, okay, that's actually completely fine, in my opinion. Oh, oops, I thought that would be a shot. Fine. Was that almost Borsonado? 
Oh well. Yeah, I'm just cooking up like a massive amount of army here. But it means that I might want to get the dungeon down here too. Mm. Wait, that was quite a few manticores gone. Damn. When did I expect them? Minus five. Not worth. Uh, Mono Kings, sure. Nothing much in here. And yeah, but it's fun. I think I just go for like another boss and back off. But I mean, we are getting a lot of boxes though. We have like a pretty solid army here by this point. From middle alone. And yeah, I'm pretty happy I left my mana available to me. This will make it so much better. Wow, the scanum. And red dragons too, damn. But I think I actually need to go for my dungeon down in the biome by this point. I also think that I need to research into the air. Yeah. So was I correct in backing off? I was very correct in backing off. Uh, yeah, I would have just died. <laughs> Interesting. Mm, so yeah. Uh, out of options available to me. Uh, PDF is looming, looming in my head. Um, uh, maybe some Black Dragon push, but that would be on week four. That's pretty late. <clears throat> Not sure if that's gonna be like the primary way to go. Uh, here, here. Yeah, I can push pretty out of Desert Town too. And we have some good artists here in the side as well. Uh, I could be going for the Sandals into the side zone. Could be going for some Utopia action. <clears throat> yeah, I kind of do want Utopias by now. But yeah, my army is stacked. If I could get casting in a bit more stats, then I could already push middle. But that's not the case right now. I'm not finding good RTs. Not yet, at the very least. You're playing 2 for 2 or 1 to 1? 2 for 2. Uh, 2 for 2. Uh, okay. He picks up whatever was here. Mm hmm. And it's potentially gonna be staying out, but um, yeah, we'll see. Hey, it's Ike. So wait, I think I do go for my buy him down here. Like, I need this dungeon down. I, uh, there's like so many things that I should be developing into. And uh, if I'm not, then it's quite a bit worse. Or maybe, maybe I could like continue tempo. Don't worry, it was just an SLJ and a line shield, no big deal, bro. Uh, he's back. Yeah, no, I'm not going for the town yet. Ooh, uh, Titanium. Mm, that's a little bit rough. Wow! Cannon to kill two Titans. Minus one box. Uh, worth of army here for me. Um, and I really need to roll into scouting though. Mm, hopefully that will work out. Hmm, Olgerfest. I currently have zero support for it so far. And I can't even afford these anyway, so I'm not really sure what I'm wondering, wondering about. Eh. Uh, give the ding into like really bad fights. No, 
Oh, this is gonna get annihilated. No, okay, it doesn't. Yeah, that, that's okay. Oh, okay. Um, library here is a wonderful find. And yeah, I have only one more level up chance here for scouting. I do have Water Magician too, though. And that makes me not want to go for... Yeah, that makes me not want to go for, like, some of the things as well. I do have a Water Dome available to me that I can see. That's good. Uh, but a Water Dome I could maybe, like, fight without the Air Dome. But I would still need, like, quite a bit more stats. And I would like more Army Tia at the same time. Hmm. If it goes to game 3, can you make it a gentleman's duel? 312, please. No. Isn't Jeremy a rush hero? Kind of only good early mid. Yes, but uh, he's still a might hero. I mean, and it's possibly better late game than sorcery anyway. Well, the questionable too, but... No, it's not like I have to rush here with this. Uh, I could be farming up bosses here too, but like, yeah, this, um, uh, the side zone was pretty painful. Like, the fights are pretty bad, and also I'm not getting other stuff either. I mean, Wisdom would not be the worst either, I could then go uh, and guarantee all the spell casting that I would need. Uh, which would of course be very, uh, nice. But yeah, not seeing the buy me topia is also pretty bad. Uh, the only Utopia that I see is going to be this one over here. Um, that I could deal. The fact that I haven't found a Utopia here in the side zone, deal. Ugh. Icky. Uh, lower. At some point. I currently have Cat on my lap. I don't want to edit my Cat. Uh, my Cam position, okay? It's too much of an edge, and the cannon seems to be no joke. Well, yeah. Oh, he's just on, like, right here, and I can see his army too. Um, it's not very good yet, actually. So he's, like, playing fully on casting. Ooh, I could be checking out the... Oh no, only if they don't flee, which I can actually check. I mean, only if they flee. Okay. Scouting? Oh my god! I found it. Wait, that's amazing. Jeez, just like that. Now I need to not breath anything too important. I think it's this and this that I'm gonna be breathing into. Okay, they choose not to abuse that. Advance and an air tome and interference. Yo, I'm almost able to fight. Honestly, if I recover mana now and push, I might be able to just kill him. Because my army is better. And my stats here are probably not behind either. At least by much. Especially with the. In I mean, yeah, because of the interference. Uh, no air orb yet, though. I'd be doing this utopia and like pushing. And I can then do the uh, seal of sunset here as well. And his power is going to be down to nothing because of that. But what did he do? Nothing yet. Okay. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> uh, okay, we're cooking up some really good stuff here. Uh, now, the next thing for me is going to be probably this... Uh, well, actually, I have scouting. I don't have to push. Like, maybe he's building out too. Anyway, library and the Utopia plus the Scouting University. Good stuff. <laughs> and yeah, my worst regret is not having the Dungeon Town. Like, it's so bad. Maybe I could pick it up still. Like, I would go here, do the Utopia, then come back, do the Air Tom, uh, I mean Air Orb, and then get the town. Then I can actually Vortex for my middle push. But yeah, I need more stats as well. 
Wait, he hasn't moved yet. But his timer is sticking. Is he like trying to find where I am or something? Oh, I see what's happening. Yo, that would suck if we... If we can't play because of the lobby. Hmm. Yeah, the lobby seems to be running into some issues here. Um, Air Orb of, uh, on Bitlords. I think those are Magogs now. And yes, I do see him. And yes, I am planning to go for it. Activate Baratorch Premium. Well, maybe I will. Game Ranger Hamachi, let's go. Hmm, nah. I said this was a 24 hour stream. No. No, 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 no. Uh, nah, bro. <laughs> Wait a moment. Hmm. It's not toxic. In fact, imagine playing 40 hours a week for weeks and still be that inconsistent, man. <clears throat> um, a lot of this, you came back to cause some issues. Why are you feeling so bitter? Did something happen? <laughs> uh, do, you have, do you have extra caffeine? Uh, no. Can you fix? Oh yeah, my cat just left, so I can indeed fix the camera. Wait, it should be... Mm -hmm. Um, yeah. Okay, uh, so he did take the necklace over here. And some more power to you at the same time. So now he's sitting at 31, but this might not be all of his power though. That'd be a pretty scary thing. Okay, I'm farming up Utopias. I'm looking for SOJ, Lion Shield... Yeah, there's still so many good Arteries that I could possibly get that, um... I do want to go for these. And this is a pretty big one. Not buffing anything important, that's good. Clear frame. Ooh, wait, no, that's not even that good. Meh. Oh, I didn't equip my air thumb. Yikes. It's a mistake, not to. So let me do sequins. Uh, I think by this point I would just want to go to the steering and build out the Yarter Matrix and see. Uh, these are pretty good. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be equipping the top here for this turn. Um, for a very simple reason. Because I feel like the next mana pool is gonna be there for killing the opponent. So, I just wanna be... Yeah, I just wanna be ready. But I also want the water tone, but I can't really find one. I mean... Yeah, I really want to pressure him on this week. I feel like that's massively, massively important. I'm not sure which chess piece to equip either, though. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna be able to probably do this Utopia, and then DD over to, like, this boss as well. Um, any army here that I can get alongside the, yeah, along the way, it's gonna be like a pretty big boost for me. And I want that big boost. I need that big boost. Then maybe like, uh, seal the sunset and then attack, finally. And that's gonna be my line of play. We were asking to move the cam and overlay. Oh, right. Not sure if this is where I was before, but damn. Mm 
Um, yeah, there we go. <clears throat> then wait, I need to see my chat and yeah. Not, oh, not having both overlay and cam group. I can't. Uh, professional, by the way. Dude, but I just need like one good utopia though. Like one utopia of destiny here to carry me like all the way. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he has not found this library quite yet. And uh, yeah, we still have like quite a bit uh, of our of our own stuff to get as well. <laughs> Block everyone that does not see the world like you is fine until it is not. Rude awakening coming. <laughs> Question mark? Towards who? Camera not centered in the frame, I hate it. Okay. Wait. Into which direction does the camera move? Like a two pixel gap. Where? Eighty-two game. Oh, uh, okay. We are moving out, and yeah, we're gonna be doing the Utopia. Ooh, what a town! Oh, uh, I kind of want that. Yeah, kind of want that. Oh. Well, I guess I get it. This feels like an elixir fight to me. Uh, but maybe that's my overly optimistic thinking. <laughs> it is, it is. Uh, okay, so now let's equip, uh, as properly as I can for the Finalka. That may or may not be happening right now. My opponent does have, like, a lot of power, but I have, like, so many good, uh, yeah, so much good stuff on my own too. That I think I'll be fine. <clears throat> let's see, huh? How come Jeremy? Hey, Random and I. And I'm playing Jeremy because, uh... Yeah, this is just the um, stipulation that was enforced for this game. We just had like a matchup decided, like Red Jeremy versus Blue Solmir. And I ended up taking arms with Jeremy. <laughs> no matter can be an issue. I don't think the fight would last that long. I feel like I would be able to blow my opponent now before the mana issue came into play. Uh, that's my hope here. Uh, by the way, like, Shav, aren't you tired from the long stream? Yeah, I'm getting, like, a little bit tired by now, yeah. But, I mean, it's gonna be okay. And if I played a bit better, I would win the series, but... The peg. Hmm. Um? Feral Peldame. Yes, that did happen. That is accurate lore. Hmm. Wait, did he double those, I wonder? Uh, why else would he have done the fight? Wait, did he double something big already this early into the game? He had more gold than I did. Whoa, that would be scary. Uh, but let's see. That's even more of a reason than for me to attack. Hmm. You're showing some high, high stats. Ooh, seven. No force field. 
Oh, I can't even tank with these that well. Is there anything that I can do? I can prayer and move out of the way. But prayer is a big commitment. Let's commit it. Yeah, this is one stock, that's okay. And now... BOOM! Yeah. That feels pretty nice. Okay, I don't think he deployed anything. Or maybe, like, those cats came from somewhere. Wait, yeah, from box. He does have lots of Cyclops, though. 26, 234. Uh, these stacks are out. Um, how do I do this properly? I think I just want to go full in immediately. And where will the Master Golden stand? I don't know. Wait, I don't know game mechanics. Oh, no. I feel really bad about not knowing this. This is the equipment. My attack is, like, way, way higher. Like, I want the Gremlins to stand immediately so I can hit the Cyclops and then those. So I think it's like this and this. I also have the speed and the Red Dragons will be even faster. This over here. This over here. Yeah, I think this is good. Okay. Yeah, he's just gone. He is hella gone here. Uh, yeah, okay. So, he's kind of out of army. Immediately into the fight, and that's awesome. Like, almost absolutely nothing here remaining for him. I also have the can to shoot with, the Medusa Queens to shoot with, and some fallback options. Uh, yeah. Please flex. I'm not sure if I'm in a position to flex. But yeah, the big chain here comes out, and uh, I'm not sure if Stygian will be able to hold on here in this free 3 finale cup. Cannibal Bonk nicely as well. Yeah, I really wish I had Golden Bow. This Golden Bow would actually make the cannon do like uh, a ridiculous amount of damage. An actually ridiculous amount of damage, but, um, wait, sorry. Um, mm -hmm. yeah, sorry. I'm no longer black screen will be happening. Mm hmm. He actually waits on the Master Genius. Um, okay. He might just be summoning and hitting. Uh, it'd be a decent lot of play, I guess. What do you mean? He's winning. Yeah. Okay, summons the stack here. And yeah, he's for a lot. It's for a whole, whole lot. I don't want these guys to be buffing at all, so I'm just gonna kill them with the cannon. Cannon already having some value here. See, now I have to double move back out and then chain them really, really hard. And he's down to almost nothing, and I think this is gonna be the end of the road here for Mr. Stygian in game number one. Uh, okay, so yeah, he summons, but uh, we need to block the gates. Yeah, okay. He just GG's out. He sees me as the superior here in this fight. And yeah, GG's. Thanks for playing. Thanks for coming. My top is not deliver, but uh, yeah, this Jeremy just deals too much damage. This was a really good skill tree. And he managed to Diplo on the last turn here too. He Diplo actually all of the Cyclops that he had there and some more cats steal. 
Uh, the Dimple came in like pretty late though, um, as it did for me. Though despite not having scouting, he did find like all the best in South Relics, but still that did not end up being good enough. Uh, nice. Um, yeah. <laughs> camera, camera. Which direction do I push it? I don't know. I don't see it. Down? Do I push it down? Like this? Top. Like, does the top... You wouldn't see it on black. It needs to go up a tiny bit. Oh, okay. Now? Uh, I wanna do... AR... Uh, one for two... From final fight or something? <laughs> Not gonna lie, I'm, I'm saying this for maybe like a little bit of a shorter game because I'm kind of tired. Sure, why not? By the way, I went to free bay. Damn. Uh, awesome. I did the uh, 127 only. Put us on screen. Okay, that's also fair. Uh, so. Uh, zero one. 1 Well, this is gonna be the game that we're good. But give me right this time. Uh, earn it. Hmm. One, and it says zero. <laughs> Good luck, have fun. Oh, wow. Well. Sorry, Mr. Stigeon. You should win. Uh, you should win this. You were very lucky. Could reach you if you had the air to check before backing up. Also, Borg 1 to frame. Had insane tempo. Very, very lucky. Mm hmm. Oh, this is gonna be like an interesting game. Uh, you are the eternal goldmine guardian. Enjoy. Then this, this, and I get to like upgrade my into a big stack of pillar. Wait, it's gonna be like interference versus resistance. That's interesting. Uh, I'm down. But like, in I'm gonna be forced to fight a foregrim in the early game. Uh, that's not so good. Wait, well, but I do have resistance. I can maybe, like, just summon out spam him. Uh, come from middle here. Hmm. Yeah, so now I get to pick up my... My army and I will be good to go. And my army is... Oh my god, look at that. That's a beautiful looking army. One for two Fenalka. We don't need... well... No. I'm also faster on these guys, by the way. They're speed 8, so... Yeah, I gotta be having a decent check of moves here. Uh, we see boxes. I do want this resource. Mm, yeah. And I have a DD for next turn available as well. Uh, yep. Day 5, we're gonna be having free towns. We also got some wooden ore. Uh, these boxes are gonna be amazing. Actually, I could almost do a magic university. Ooh, box. Scouting! Nice! I don't know where's the town actually. Like, not that all. Wait, where is the town? It's quite a bit to the right. I mean, to the left. Not that we're here. So, how do I get to him? Is it down? Hmm. Is here. Nice. Oh, uh, found it. <laughs> well, we are already having some pretty good tempo. Mm. 
I think I do want to Vortex here in this turn. And then I'll be probably staying out as well. Ooh, wait, this is really, really bang. I will be needing to kite here pretty, pretty well. Ooh, that's a huge morale cut that will very heavily influence the fight. One, two, three, one, two, three. It doesn't really matter. It did not get stuck there though. Okay, I'll just morale my way to victory, lol. Mm, sad. My first real hit that I took here. Nice! Max of Treasury done. Then this fight is easy peasy. Maybe a little bit of a town hall. And uh, my opponent does not have like another town yet here though. Ooh. Oh, that's a huge fight. That's awesome. Oh, Gamble? Oh, wait. Is this pretty prediction for game one? Yeah, okay. So, like, she wins and we can do another. Yeah, another. Mm hmm. Um, there you go. Mm -hmm. Oh, oops. Well, it doesn't matter. These guys kind of morale, so they're gonna be just very, very credible. That second dying is fine. Yeah, this doesn't feel clean. That is gonna be clean enough. Oh, uh, this is botting into my timer quite a bit, though. Mm, clean enough. <laughs> Uh, Medusas are amazing here. <clears throat> but now what do I do? I guess I DP back immediately. 
Or do I try to out sharp the sharpies? Oh yeah, actually, actually I can fly. So I can get the other treasure at the very least. And yeah, it's a good and easy one to go for. But I cannot see my chat. Oops. Okay, now good. Is this all random thorny? No. But it's like a random rule thorny. Where we just invent the rules based on whims. Uh, basically just rule R. But uh, yeah, with some bigger rules once in a while. Uh, that is the tournament. Okay, so by now I can fly, do this. Pick up my evil eyes, and yeah, the army is looking very nice. Oh, uh, that library holds like a lot of stuff next to it. I like it, and I really want to be the first one to break and to actually be defending metal, because I'm just planning to defend on. A bunch of summons, and that's how I will forego the interference. I mean, the resistance. Hmm. Naga break over here. Uh, pretty soon doable, and we get to bully even more of these dwarves. That's awesome. So interference versus resistance. I wonder what I wonder what will end up being better. Oh uh, yeah. So next time I'm collecting the this and this, and then I'm buying up my schools of magic, and then I'm gonna be pretty good at the game after that. I'm not sure if I can do the shield, so I will just choose not to. Mm-hmm. Wow. Just great, amazing gameplay here. Wow. Oh. Not very challenging. Just too good. Plenty of good bosses to go for, and I'm gonna be leveling up. Ooh, okay. Uh, what does he have? Ooh, he has a pretty big army there. Also, want the tavern. Ooh, his stats are amazing too, and his army is really, really, really big too. Damn. Um, this seems rough for me. Ooh. These bosses are so nice though. And they, they focus troll die, that's even better. And another. I also have the red advantage here too. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, a hundred evil eyes by now. Uh, this fight though... Makes... Actually fine. Mm -hmm. And 25 more Medusas, and this fight is a pretty small one. Now I can do these Medusas, these Enhancers... Uh, I'm gonna be all pretty great objectives. I do... I would like to buy up my chapel though. Mm, I do have some resource gain, but not much. Yeah, not much. Uh, I have a vibrant break over here. Yeah, I think I'm just going for those two bosses and then probably going for the break after. Uh, how much XP for my... Oh, okay. So I will be able to, like, double the D next turn pretty easily. Good, good, good. Do some boss here, do some boss here. But, like, yeah, we're not going for all of these. I might probably do a stockpile next turn if I can. 
He has to like DD here, DD here, and fly here. And that way I can actually upgrade my Medusa just in time. Then I have a big Medusa stack, big uh, Beholder stack, and that's awesome. <clears throat> I'm still dead, yes. Mm hmm. I do want to fight. Hmm, Harpy, I forgot these exist then. Mm, pretty big. I think it's fine. Uh, Troll dies finest, yeah. I'll just accept that and move on. Wait, can I actually... Yeah, I don't think I reached this, so I have to reach for this instead. It's because I don't have like any unit to make me fast win. Yeah, I don't actually want to fight these ones, though. Medusa Queen's here? Oh my god. And yeah, next time it's chapel upgrade is gonna be easy. Then I get to make fast uh, on the fast unit by this point. So, yeah, there's some very many Medusa Queens and very many Evil Eyes. Uh, that's gonna be awesome. And maybe I'll just do the Naga Brave because it's easier. Then just push on through the desert. You win? Yes, I did win game number one with Jeremy. Dude, Stygian was rolling so well. Just... Yeah, but I'm I'm just better. Mm hmm. Hey, Golden Bell. Nah. Don't want to. Wait, he did north, so he might be actually going uh pushing for the desert by now. That'd be a yikes. So yeah, Chapel of Stilled Voices. Hey, thank you, Feral. Much appreciated. Hell yeah. For the Jeremy Shan. Mm -hmm. Uh, this, this, this. I think I'm just going. <laughs> yeah, so this is gonna be a 1 to 5 break here for me in this game. I would also like to set up. See, then I morale every time. Oh, they do have leadership, so. It's not that surprising. Yeah, I should be able to just knock them out as they come. This time, Fenelka. I'm not sure if Log is even that good, though. Wow, I get to get, go inside of town, too. But instead of buying this Mage Guild, I would like... Oh, actually, I don't have an option for that at all. Oh, okay. I thought I had more Marketplace, but I just made a mistake. I don't. Yeah, so I'm going to be just doing all of this content. Oh, okay, so Stigian is not in the desert yet, but the stats are getting a little bit worrisome. Yeah, quite a bit worrisome, actually. Big stream today, Paul guys. Yeah, hey, Rotten. Appreciate yourself. Thank you, thank you. Hmm. Yeah, no work this kind of sucks for me. And yeah, reaching the sound didn't do anything. And it's not really going to get any better here in the next turn either. Interesting. I really want the SLJ here though. Like in... Yeah, I want the uh, box, stockpile, SLJ. And then I just want to uh, TP into the other uh, mana vortex and wait for the mana and then go middle. Uh, very confidently and well. Mm-hmm. I do kind of want to split. I do want these one stacks. Um, yeah. I 
you want to kind of bait him in? Oh wait, this is the big stack. Okay, I managed to block for it in time, but jeez. That's not very good of me to have that be a thing. I'm wondering if I want to fly here in this turn. Probably do. All magmares are gonna be pretty good. A very minimal amount of resources, but um, I didn't really need much more, so I'm gonna be fine. Confirm, Lexi like is still Lex skill is higher than Stygian. Confirmed by the last five years at least. Well, wait, oops. Anyway, I don't feel like last game I got lucky, okay? Just saying. Okay, that's good. Yeah, the fight is going very well. Eh, I guess I will give this. Hmm. Oh, he's pushing through middle, maybe into the desert. Oh, that'd be quite the journey. Oh my god, he's making the journey. But now I have insane mana, and if I can just pick up some casting along the way to middle, then I feel like I should win. Yes! Um, okay, maybe... Think about that luck skill. It is what it is. And yeah, I'm going here with insane mana too. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so yeah. Now we have exactly what we want, exactly what we need. Oh, but his stats though. Oh, but he must have some weaknesses here. That I will be able to find and exploit. Hmm. Oh no. That's fine. Hmm. Okay, he holds on to middle here. And am I gonna be just making a Pepega desperate push here? Hmm. It'd be pretty bad to back off too, though. So maybe it's the right call to make. Anyway, I will have like an insane amount of interference. So, his power is going to be down to nothing. Hmm. Oh, pain.
<clears throat> uh, okay. So, he's down to 10 power, but he has resistance. But I have the pretty big shooter stack. Do I just try to chain through, though? Filthy Red Rusher. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know, how do I play this? Well, nice specialty. <laughs> Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> mm hmm. Okay. <clears throat> we can't see your mana. It's currently 145. Oh, okay, it doesn't chain me. Interesting. Mm hmm. How do I play this? Clicks bottom while talking. Uh, yeah. Ooh. Goes for the speed power play. Okay. It's gonna be kind of fine for me, I guess. Uh, ooh. Goes for the air alleys. Okay. Did I just keep on chaining him? It's a pretty funny if I do. Hmm. 40. Well, it's still something. I mean, it's a pretty mad play to try and deal. Ah. Oh. Sometimes unlucky. But he does have Nerf Tom. Or maybe he's playing with a hat. Yeah, maybe he's maybe he's playing with a hat. In case he's a hat gamer, there's more stuff that I can do against that, actually. But I need to get, like, these down a little bit more, I think. Yeah, I think he's a hat gamer. Hmm. Uh, dangerous. Yeah, a bit of dangerous. Wouldn't Airshield be a good cast? For a long fight, yeah, but I'm not sure if I want this to be that long of a fight. And now he has like air limitals all over me. Hmm. Okay, so do I go for another one? Nah, I think I'll just summon myself. Yeah, we're gonna be meeting him head on here in this summon battle. Oh, he actually deals more damage. Oh yeah, because that's our better. Yeah, so he only has summons here for himself. He doesn't have anything else. I wonder if I can abuse that somehow. Hmm. Ooh, these guys are gonna be shooting for a lot. Ooh, a morale steal. Damn. Mm, that is pretty unfortunate. Uh, okay. Mm. Okay, now he's above average, by the way. On um, the resist. Maybe if I summon, I could just... No, but like, I can't get to the Grand Elves ever. And now I'm like, getting kind of overwhelmed here. Yeah. Too bad. I don't think... I mean, maybe if it doesn't resist like another uh, single one, maybe? But like, even then. And by the way, it's like, uh, probably not quite 40% here. Bruv. Ah, sad man. I really hoped he wouldn't have casting here by one for one, but one for one in middle with all of this is like a very big game for him. That's what you get for early air tome, deserved. Huh? Oh, says you. Hot gamer.
I mean, yeah, that's pretty. I would take Air Tomb over that Garbo anytime. Well, anyway, I don't think you can complain about this game here, but yeah. Hmm. Maybe I should have played on Air Elemental Steel though. But like, I didn't have the might to come uh, to uh, like pl play alongside it. Okay, one one. Wait a moment. So we will have a decided game. No, oh, no scouting here. But as the SOJ already. And finds a hat here on the last turn. Yeah, damn. Ah, no scouting. Mmm, so do you buy him? Or desert? I'll leave some boxes here, and yeah, it has like an amazing setup. Mm hmm. Um. Let's play a normal one to end it. <clears throat> Let's see. Please, Mr. Lashab, let me go to sleep. I'm um, after break. Oh, I see. Mm -hmm. Do I missed one DD to that? Hmm. Staying up another hour. Well, at least. Uh, let's finish with all random. Um, sure. Okay, let's go all random. Uh, two minutes, please. Okay, two minutes and we can finish it off. <laughs> hmm. Um, ready. Uh, zero or one. Hope you have fun with all this resist. Dude, I, ah. And it's a zero. Go like a fun. Too bad. Mm-hmm. Like you no know, sleep? Nope. And this is the decider game for whether I'm gonna be staying in my own tournament or I'm gonna be not in, or I'm gonna be knocked out. Oh, Ares, lol. I don't think I'll, okay, I'll look. Uh, yeah. One on one immediately. He doesn't like Marius. Marius is actually the go to pick for Karaka's Inferno, for example. And he would pick uh, it over the Eras. We try to read Drake versus Axis. Hmm. Yeah, I just really wanted to see the Goldmine Guard before I make uh, more decisions. Look at the stuff. Stuff out like this to you. Hmm, okay. Is this a matchup and a game that I'm going to be comfortable playing? I mean, Inferno is pretty good, but like, hmm, I get to go full income immediately. Is this possible? Yeah, it is. So I can go here, 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 here. But where's my the rest of my scrolls? Like here. Hmm. Then I come back, knowledge up, oh, with vortex, and I'm gonna be like kind of cooking. Yeah, okay, let's play. Uh, maybe I go black dragon steel if the game would allow. I'm gonna be like pretty low resource in this game because, uh. Yeah, I'm picking up a bunch of stuff. Hair Magician! Yes! Okay, that that's good. That's really good. So, this is already gonna be like a pretty good start. I'm gonna be Dimension Dooring like very early and quite a bit. Hmm. But like, hmm. I do have my Dimension Door here. I cannot fly or anything. So, yeah. It's just Vortex, Army. Do I take the tall dice though? That's the question. I mean, I'm. Uh, it would be basically this and this, or all of this. Mm. My scroll might be down here, so I need to actually go here. Okay. Because I wanted to grab the Orpid Teal uh, for a potential drum game. But, like, I also want to make pass on the. Okay, I think I. Yeah, I think I'm gonna be making fast here and then DDing up. Uh, maybe I can fly. No. Oh wait, uh, that doesn't matter. The magical doesn't matter at all. Then we DD up and we see him. The opponent's by him. He has a dungeon town right next to a pile. 
Uh, this is gonna be my biome, I don't see a lot of it. Um, uh, the middle is gonna be Necro, Fortricide, and Bunker, Gamba. Uh, yeah, in a bit. So D4, I left my army in the gold, in the, um, I regret everything. Oh no, oh no, I need to be, oh no, I'm misplaying. Like, pretty horribly too. That's so bad. Oh no, I'm just so bad. Yeah, I'm just bad. Okay, um... If I get knocked out here, then it's gonna be my fault, holy. Of course. <sighs> I'll pick up the, um... Yeah, I'll pick up these and then leave, I guess. Uh, I'm leaving with less DDs. Oh, okay. This is good, though. Then, day 6 down, day 7 down. That's pretty horrible. Maybe I could go for my main the next turn with a good DD. Day 6 main on this many towns would be not that bad, I guess. Never punished. Well, it's still quite a bit punished, but... Yeah. Hmm. <sighs> okay. I... I wouldn't be, like, stuck anywhere, even if I YOLO DD, I think. I'm gonna be trying to stay on the road, though. I think this is a pretty good DD, yeah. And yeah, let's do Gambo. Uh, prediction... Not many believed in Stygian, but he did prevail, and now we go for who will win game 3. Uh, prediction start. There you go. Mm -hmm. Ooh, and we have like some early bosses here too. Nice. Mm, I'll put a low one. Uh, sure. And I get to, yeah, sit in the stand right now. And I guess I'm gonna be vortexing immediately. So I'm probably not playing dragon, so I'm gonna be playing tempo. Uh, cause I, yeah, I don't see any support for it, and I'm kinda slow anyway. I will, uh, oh yeah, I have the spellbook because I'm Atari. And now we get to uh, go for the boxes. We do have tactics to set up like a little bit better. Mm. The first stack is gonna be the one to go here, so I wanted that one to be lower, naturally. Mm, do I go for log immediately? I think I skip it for now. And we get a Hoppy Hack box here immediately. I actually didn't expect it to be as big, actually. Uh, this one is a Straw Dice. Actually, I expected it to be exact opposite. Honestly, I'm not sure if I'll be better than Otto. I think my Hoppy Hacks are not in the best spot either. Mm, I think I'll move here. Yeah, then I get to... And yeah, we get the Infernal Trogs, and, uh, we get the DD, maybe like TP and DD uh, back into the other side, or do I just go this one? I think I just go this one. Um, yeah. Wait, uh, I don't see chat, oops. Mm-hmm. Um, so... I can see my library here, but I'm only level 2. That's ridiculously low. Yeah, that's quite ridiculously low. We got more knowledge, but I'm not gonna be like... Uh, buying stuff out here. I don't really have... Yeah, I don't see like a lot of content to go through. Um, Yeah, let's go out to marketplaces for now, so I can be... Uh, safer in my resources and, uh, in whatever I want to do down the line. Mm-hmm. Giant Cave summons. No, I don't believe that this is the play. He has a pretty good box here. He also has, uh, three towns here for now. Uh, Sidon is also, like, playing pretty fast. But I have zero clue of, like, what kind of game he's having here for now. 
I can double DD and TP, as in like DD somewhere here, walk and farm, and then DD back as well, um, in some time. Disregard armor, pet the cat. Yeah, the cat deserves some pets. Hey, it's us, John. Wait, I mean, happy birthday. It's not my birthday. No. Uh, Alicia playing, Alicia playing like he's awake for 20 hours. Yeah, imagine. Okay, uh, but I do have the timer. I don't have to like rush that bad lane. So I have to keep that in mind and play accordingly and well. I'll need to go for Solium at some point. Uh, I think the, the Gorgons are going to be like a decent box. Marmy is fine. For the timing. Don't really need any ore. I definitely want the box. Uh, that's what I came here for. And then I see some treasures that I'll be able to just pick up for some XP as well. Mm. I think I want this here. And Wait, he can't reach. Oh, okay. And maybe the opposite. Will do. Yeah, this will do. Some more harpies. Um, yeah. Yeah, so I'm not being back as I... Oh, okay. So, we have both our schools of magic already, but I will not be going for logistics until I get the, these up back to expert. I mean, up to expert. Um, yeah. So, army development, good hero development. Uh, we're kind of cooking. I could be going over here, mana vortexing, picking up some army, and then going back to this town, and then immediately out as well. We can look at what the opponent's up to. Some decent freedies, decent gogs. Oh, he's having a good game. Not what I like to see right now, but. Dude, so just gonna be having three game good games in a row that. Oh, I didn't mean to. It's fine. And I will go for this one as well. I just want as much army quantity as I possibly can get. And I think I. Yeah, I go for the Gorgon fight. It's gonna be a decent box here too. One for two as well, by the way. Uh, nah. No limits. <clears throat> oh. One stack though. Is my armor really that high? Evil eyes. Uh, okay. Ooh. Uh, that's kind of a box. Interesting. Wow, it just goes from one to the other immediately. I do have expert shield and expert sun skin. I feel like I should probably do this. What is here? Uh, another box. Hmm. Uh, this one is definitely easier, and it will make the other fight easier too, so... Seems like a reasonable line of play to go here right now. I also really want to bait these guys in, so I can just knock them down. Uh, 20 Medusas, okay. So I might be able to break sometime soon by now. And another box of a dead teal. I mean, yeah, I just need like an insane box quantity here in this game. I won't want to bait one of those in. Uh, the other ones can chill. Uh, shield up immediately here, DTL, some possible misadventures like that. Okay, Troll Dive Focus is not very scary for me. D 
These are going to be some amazing boxes, by the way. Yeah. Oh, scouting. No, I think I need... Well, yeah, I need to pick up the scouting. Damn. I'm, I mean, scouting is good, of course, but... I'm not sure if I can afford it uh, right now. Because I really didn't want to slow down my expert air here. I'll be on more boxes. Exactly what I'm looking for. I will need the chapel. I have my... Get yeah, that thing inside. I mean, I should be taking these fights. Do you stack some of these, but like one stack of Gorgons? Not very consistent, but... Yeah, it's not usually. Oh. Minus one, one stack, and that's a pretty bad level up. So I'm having like a pretty similar game to the last time, I guess. I mean, log is also good, but like, no, I cannot do that. Do I have to be back right now? Uh, I can almost do the library by this point. And I saw the DD. Uh, I think it's gonna be... Um, there's some fight over here. I'm kind of curious, but let's keep it a little bit more tame. Oh, uh, yeah. I do want to upgrade, yeah, I do want to upgrade, like, both of these stacks. Uh, let's start off with the chapel. Yeah, so once again, we have a pretty insane amount of shooters here. Um, this is good. And now, what do we do? Uh... Just running over to that town seems uh, extraordinarily weak. We have a real basket blocks because I need this expert air like way sooner. Like double DD is like very game enabling in many ways. And if I don't have it, then I... Well, my game is not enabled. I'm doing like way, way less. Um, sword is nice. And yeah, I'm just kind of running. It's not amazing, but... Yeah. Then I guess I'm only breaking one through one. Yeah, I'm breaking one through one, exactly. And then I'm going to be trying to play, uh, outplay him in the middle. I do have scouting already. Uh, the break will basically... Oh my god, the goose and the box. Uh, that's kind of content, but... Hey, wait, um... Uh, what did I do? I didn't have the mana for this. Wow, um... Hmm. That's rough. We'll be able to reach the town here next turn, then Vortex, and then immediately, like, DD somewhere, but... Oh no, I'm... I'm playing badly. That feels very bad. Mmm, these stats are amazing again. Oh no. Yeah. Seems like a pretty well-deserved loss here. Oh no. Mmm. 
Maybe I have some excuses in my mind, but it is what it is. So yeah, next time I'm just going for the break. Uh, whatever it may be here, I need to do it, and so I will. He does have five pants here, more than I do. He's summoning Ephrides here as well, while getting like all the Phylakes too. Uh, seems like a pretty grim situation for me right now. Uh, the break fight should give me like loads of its speed in order to get up the expert air and like get some scouting going. And then from there, I might be able to like uh, cook something up here. Hmm. Not over yet, Stygian can also throw. Um, well, yeah, but that's gonna be like pretty unlikely. Pretty unlikely. Hmm. But not on Lexi's level. Yeah, I'm just very off point here. Like, completely. So... Well, also Stygian is having like, some amazing games, by the way. I'm impressed. Uh, yep. Are you going to fourth then? No, not at all. I'm gonna do my best till the very end. And yeah, try to pull out a win here. Uh, side zone here is gonna be like not too interesting. Side zone here... I mean like some SOJ, but it's like pretty fire. Mm, maybe. If I were to get offered Diplo, would I take it? Certainly not before I spread air, but maybe after? Yeah, we'll see. One of the Fizzy series, uh, Phantom. Phantom ended up being the winner here. Wait, for those of us, uh, who are slow, can you explain why you think it's GG? Uh, I'm, like, way too slow here. By, uh, by the start of week 3, I should have had, like, my, uh, air matters up already some. And, uh, I also, like, made some crucial mistakes here. Like, missing out on mana here. Uh, that meant I basically lost the turn. Then, uh, over here, when I left the army in the orbit in the beginning of the game, that was a little minus a turn. And when the opponent's having, like, a good game, you can't really afford to be losing turns like this. So... Basic is like a pretty well deserved loss because of these reasons. It just feels like my opponent is uh, running circles around me, which is probably a pretty well warranted uh, thought. I think I do want to bait the monarchs in. Yeah, the bird fight is gonna be pretty easy. I get to preserve her one stack there. This is fine. Yeah, no big stacks remain. Still not expert air. Oof, 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 oof. I need a secondary to the I mean, I'm not a Dedeen. Yeah, it's one free tail. Okay, and we have like some decent looking bosses over here too. Uh, Stygian is also still in the biome. Uh, which is a pretty encouraging thing to see. But like, yeah, I got this expert air immediately into the game and then I could never level it for the life of me. <clears throat> so... I mean, I even got my estates. Uh, the skills that cannot be rolled for should be like way less likely to be like leveled up too. But, yeah. It's good, up. thank you. Like a few vampire bosses would let me farm up all the utopias for free. And uh, my preferred next skill is gonna be a logistics here for sure. I'm gonna be trying to make a pretty good uh, mid army. 
I do not use my vortex here yet. Yeah, I didn't use my second vortex yet. I think I'm not using it next turn, but I'm gonna be using the the turn after. Mm -hmm. A Waro nest with a big, huge raid. Thank you. Welcome. I am into a very, very long stream where I am playing a tournament that I host in. And uh, yeah, I'm pretty tired and I'm currently in a the match point up against the gen. We're 1-1. One, one. And one of us is going to be falling. And yeah. Time to learn Russian. Uh, nah. So yeah, the Necro Army here will need to do a lot of work for me. Um, hopefully. <clears throat> you should win this because you're the best. Oh, how nice. <clears throat> oh, where the Kozo says? Well, uh, he is dead. Ish. <clears throat> um, so yeah. Citadel is probably going to be breaking in this turn and getting it this down. Uh, going to be a pretty expected outcome. I mean, <clears throat> it would be even hard to imagine where he could be, like, stumbling here. Maybe if the skill tree is, like, not too good. I'm going to be, like, aware of my mana. I can only use basically, like, two spells for the next turn in case I want to use, like, the full control. I have the option for the goose, too. Oh, yeah, I know, I know what I'm doing. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this goose is beautiful. I want that. Well, I mean, it's not that important. But it would be nice. I could be starting out to build my... Yeah, I should be also starting out the build there, too. Um, yeah. We want some one-stack arenas. And we also want to check his position. Uh, he is in the bunker. So he's either making, like, huge investments into the biome, or he's having a little bit of a rough game. And it's kind of hard to tell which one, for now. I want to bait in probably just one dragon stack, to be honest. Uh, the rest doesn't really matter. Okay, they go in. Hmm, 10 HP. And this guy's going to be taking retail to you. Okay, he didn't. Uh, that is kind of nice then. And yeah, my casting will definitely go into this fight. And not any other. That's also rough. Ugh. Laga, okay. Oh, uh, my sculptor's doing very well though. And I also have a nerf tome, so I can actually be like animate spamming my army here immediately. Would be decently nice. And yeah, I'm pretty sure just guys. Uh, hell yeah. Hey, WSS. Uh, and Vampire Lords, okay. I mean, I would need, like, another Vampire Lord box in order to make, like, very good use of it. So I can go back, 700 moves, and, um, yeah, I should be able to pick up the geese. Mm-hmm. Yes, my morale is not the best. It's also, like, not, not horrible either, though. So, we're kind of chilling. We want some more vampires, we want... Oh yeah, a few things here. Advanced Laga, then we go back to Cold Shadow. We make sure to make fast carefully. And, um... Hmm... I also really need these marketplaces right now. Uh, buy this point. I cannot buy it in the dungeon town, though. Uh, but yeah, seems like I don't need to. 
I think I have these already. The idea. And the last thing is gonna be my goose. And, uh, yeah. Oh, uh, we are kind of fine here. Yeah, we're kind of stabilizing. Maybe, maybe doable. Maybe doable. The art doubles are two out of five for Tomb of Earth for now, so I'll just go into middle after vortexing. And I'm gonna be vortexing for like 280 mana. That's amazing. Oh, by the way, oh, so Tisha got the Utopia. Dude, how does he get these stats every single time from the volume? <laughs> like, every. Well, no complaints. Okay, fine. <clears throat> Pepe left. Uh, yeah. Strange Jeebus. Uh, yeah. Good Strange Jeebus Indian. <laughs> 1000 bits. Thank you, Skedub. Wow, wow. He is. Well, yeah. I would expect him to get a desert turn by now, at the very least. He's also not coming here to pick it up. Mm, you know, the 3Ds. Mm, oh yeah, we'll see. I need stats and then I need to like farm up middle here, like really, really well. I also need to be there first. But like, it's very likely that he's gonna go like diagonal to middle again. As he did before. And it's like pretty annoying to me. Because then I do not have priority over middle at all. Uh Again. <clears throat> hmm. Okay, no, he's not going to idly middle. I'm very happy to see that. Yeah, that's great for me. Great news. Now, when I'm running around, but am I running around with this army too? I think I probably am. And yeah. Uh, library. I think it's a skip for now. Air Tome. Now that, in fact, is not a skip. I'll pick one of the stacks in, and I'll be good to go. Actually, these guys can be the second too. Assuming this has to reclaim one vampire. That's okay. I also would love to get myself the expert air gear on this turn, and yeah. Uh, many of these things will be accomplished by going for this box. Mm, that's kind of scary. I guess they will hit the vampires, but... And I will not be able to recoup them, but... I don't see a better way. Vampires are the weakest link here. Oh, it bounces here, not there. Well, those bounces didn't do a lot of damage anyway. And this is gonna be like a pretty big box deal. Um, Esper Log is very welcome. Um, yeah. Uh, we can go for the two setup, we can... Uh, continue building out the Necro. It's gonna be a very important piece of the puzzle. Mm hmm I wonder if he's gonna be pushing middle, like, immediately, immediately, or not. See, so, yeah, I minus one Vampire box, I minus a, a few Medusa Queens here. For my X4 by Tom of Air Magic, and, uh... This box. Uh, whatever it may be. Uh, what's our login being this far? I should be able to, like, get box, box, and the middle town here, all on the next turn already. That'd be pretty good. The game only job, uh, Outcast, or JC tier, empty, uh, empty JC, empty DM, Outcast, empty 100, Clash of Dragons. I used to play, like, a lot of things, uh, but I defaulted mostly on Duel. Not exclusively, but, like, mostly, by, like, pretty far. Started off with GC, played it for quite a few years, then um, I was actually like very involved in the creation of the JO format originally. And then, yeah, then developed into Duel, and that's my preferred thing to do. I 
I could be also double summoning the um, uh, Black Knights here to uh, gonna be most definitely an option. Anyway, I still have like a lot of things to take care of here in this game. I need like some big stat RTs. It feels like to me like he has them, like SRJ, Line Shield, some of that at least. Mm, but yeah, we losing? Yeah, I think that I'm kind of losing still. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'm gonna be taking the Hall of Darkness too, so I can immediately like build as big of a Black Knight stack as I can. Then, if I were to get a nerf down, then I could like do everything on those without bleeding anything at all. Uh, that'd be pretty good. There's like a little bit of PDF support here so far, but uh, not a very exceeding amount. Like we have the necklace, the shield, the armor, we have the ring and crown. So that's like five pieces, but like five is not very impressive. <clears throat> it's just like beginning to look a little bit in that direction. Hey. Damn. Didn't realize Twitch takes 90% from bits. Crap from now on tips only. <laughs> Much appreciated. But yeah. Whichever way you decide. It's very nice of you. Okay, so this is a bot. Okay, wait, so I'm gonna be getting like uh, multiple vampire bosses like very very soon by this point. I think I do want to bait both of them in. Yeah. Ooh, Chronicopium here. Oh, uh, that's an amazing find. Uh, yep. I most certainly want to be protecting my vampires by this point. Well, these guys are kind of fine though. Also, the air orb is gonna be like good. I'm missing many, many stats here still though. Side chance of resistance. Uh, both of these are really, really bad with a Necrometal. Uh, this has to be a Necro Amp, and uh... Wait, I don't think I... I, I have all my marketplaces. Yeah, okay. And then in the middle, we are of course getting the Mage Guild. Uh, my... One setup is good, my two setup is gonna be having a new friend, the Cornucopium. And yeah, now we can control middle. Uh but we have like way less stats, so it's gonna be like a Yeah, it's gonna be like only a matter of time before we get like pushed here. I believe that I no longer have a vortex either. It's a very easy ferment over there and here. I need to do my utopias, I guess, in order to like try and find some decent RPs. Uh, there's a utopia here, pretty easily avail available, over here. So yeah, maybe I just like trade out the vampires and then do utopias immediately. It should be a pretty strong line of play. Mm -hmm. Then if I get like a few decent relics, then I can defend middle. And if I can defend middle and farm up here, then yeah, might be winning. Uh, what's the point of a Necro Necromonicon? Uh, it's the Book of the Undead. You still, well, surprisingly, raise the dead. No? Not really sure what that has to do with Heroes 3. <laughs> uh, Line Shield over here. Certainly more understandable than the Amp! Anyway. It's alive. A little bit. 
slightly. I'm gonna be, yeah, I'm getting 39 Vampire Lords here. Oh, I'm gonna be pretty good. I really, really hope I don't get pushed here, though. I mean, if I get pushed, I kind of have to defend, but that would be, like, a very rough defense for me. I'd have to, like, DD over to the Magical at the end of the turn, or get, like, a good Utopia. I mean, something good would need to happen here. I mean, also, like, Firmament and Karas into... I mean, yeah. Mm -hmm. No, but he wouldn't be... I mean, would he have an air tone plus all these stats at this timing? Again? Mm, I don't know. Seems a little bit sketch. Mm -hmm. Wait, these utopias are great. And I can do them uh, both on the same turn, I would just assume. Even after two piece. No, that would be 1800 moves. So here, boom, boom. Okay, no pressure. And I can also see his army. Hmm, it's actually very, very expected army. Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, that is good news to me. Um, to here, and, uh... Yeah, okay. Uh, I get to go for the entire vampire stack. And yeah, now we go for Utopias. Actually, we're not gonna be dying here. Oh, uh, they're free. SOJ Earth Dome. That's really good. Okay, and the other one? Well, first of all, I do want to do this Air Orb too. Okay, that's a decent auto, I guess. Lion Shield! Okay, finally I'm cooking. Finally, I'm cooking. I love it. <laughs> Bro. Okay, okay, now we're doing it. So, I need to, like, keep on building up some. Oh, no, I kind of want to see more, maybe. Oh, no, I will never see, like, decently amount more. I mean... Mm-hmm. What's good about Lion Shield? Uh, it is the best stat-giving artifact for the, uh, shield slot. It gives plus four all primary stats, so now my primary stats are quite a bit higher. And I need that in order to be able to fight well, and, uh, such. <laughs> Finally! Dude, Sitin gets these in, a, in his first only thought, you know? Like, Sitin is a monster. I still have, like, this library, I have many boxes, and yeah, now I'm able to, like, do fights well. I have, a uh, Log of Scout thing. He might be missing some skill. Oh, he's actually going... Oh, no, he's go just going for the other desert town. I was gonna say, if he's, go like, going to the externals, then he might attack me, but no. This is just him pathing to the desert. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, I'm gonna be farming up as much as I possibly, possibly can. Is he demon farming? I would not assume Stygian to be demon farming, actually. Oh, what? Uh, yeah. I mean, that's an option. I don't really care for it for now. I mean, if you were to attack, you could pick it up on a very short notice, you know? Uh-huh. The guy hasn't had enough. Well, yeah, he still hasn't gone through what he needed to go through. <laughs> How am I planning on dealing with 60 to 70 sultans? Well, by the time that he has like that many sultans, I'll have like 30 ghosters. Opium.
no, I'll not do this for now. I need some better content. Um, uh, not a utopia. No, but I actually really want boxes instead. Is that a celestial? No, that's a growing copy of that. Fumbles, yeah, and I guess, um, uh, ooh. Yeah, I'm saying out here. Most definitely. Look at these beautifuls. Oh, very cool. Sandals? Yo, I keep getting upgrades for my utopias. That's awesome. Uh, so yeah. Uh, portal this, portal this. Um, portal this, motherfucker. Yeah. Amazing. Um, estate, and I can also do the mausoleum. Um, yeah. Uh, good build up. I'm about to get like quite a few extra good boxes, and uh, yeah. Considering PDF or not, uh, no, I don't think uh, PDF is gonna be like that much of a consideration here at all. Hmm. You have so many boxes. Well, I mean, they're not like they weren't next, weren't but ever next to me. Uh, but yeah, finally I found like some decent boxes. I'm pretty happy with this. No, well, they probably will both be. Kind of small, but it is what it is. I should probably then immediately go for... Wait, the actual could be attacking me on this week, still. That is a possibility. The fact that I caught up in stats here, though, is... Uh... Oh, grass, huh? Well, depends on what I want, I guess. He hasn't paid taking the Forsaken Palace, so that yeah. actually tells me a lot of his game plan about as well. So he's gonna be like going full in on a 3 I really need a Ghost Dragon so I can chain the 3Ds before he... Yeah, I need Speed Prior here very badly. Maybe I have a Red Tower somewhere. Left no. This is not water. This is not water. It is in fact not water. It is in fact not water. Mm-hmm. He doesn't know. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Is he gonna be aggro? Uh, what is he gonna be? Tell Ami I love him again for drinking. By Wazi. This was not worth it. This is the worst deal in the history of deals. Uh, he is... Sitting in the bunker. Okay. That's gonna be fine for me. I have my... Casting equipped, I'm gonna be fine. How did the auto only lose that, that few vampires? Is that all of them? Oh, that would be really, really good because I kind of am going for a pass. No, actually, I need a ghost stack though. So, what was this? But can't be ghost Hmm. Hmm. Let's go with the plow. Oh, ghost! Big. Yeah, that's, that's massive here. Um, okay, the next goal is gonna be. I guess I think this arena. What's good about the blumps here? Well, the fact that I have a million gold, uh, and I'm able to do utopias for free, so I'm gonna be able to probably use it to get some good stuff. Um, yeah, then we can go Halls of Darkness, and, uh, yeah, we can sit on economy. 
Uh, I can also board this up immediately and go somewhere. I get to pick up like four more Black Knights, and I yeah, the speed power is like a very amazing thing here. Uh, Frong rocks. Okay, that's got a few. It was hard last week, so I didn't go for it because I didn't expect the box to be so big. But yeah, it's gonna be like at the very least liches over here, and those are pretty great as well. So with so many shooters, would like the Golden Bell. I believe that I passed it up. Like it's, I was like pretty close to one at some point. Yeah. There's also one over here. Let's see, some other boss of steel. Yeah, so I'm getting army at a very rapid pace here, I think. Oh. He also has ghost. Ugh, pain. <clears throat> oh, who's behind him? Oh, that is Ami. My co host for the tournament. Does Rick's specialty apply to Rotoms? Uh, what specialty? Dragon. Oh, wait, I don't know. Wait, I can check. Uh, these guys have 49 That's attack 40 skills, 40. so they're getting 30, 25. Yeah. yeah, it actually applies to Ghosters, what the hell? Wait, 5-5 five, five stats is pretty good. Yeah, that attack's really good. I, I need to cook up some... There's yeah, and I have Diplo, by the way. And like, so I can actually Diplo like any dragons and turn them into Ghosters. So, yeah, this is gonna be like pretty heavily. Oh, this is better than a dragon chess piece for your dragons. Uh, yeah. Damn, okay, okay, I don't know. So, he probably Vortex, so is he coming at me? He might be. I'm still missing a chess piece, I mean, uh, um... Oh, he's coming at you. Hmm. I was just running the fuck out of here. No, my army is like actually kind of decent. Is it better than this? Maybe. I want this. This, you this. Risking it. You are risking it. Yeah, but like, isn't not going also we risking have it? We have a bunch of gold. Look at my I know. Gold. I know what I will do. I know what I will do. You can know I'll fight. You can check him out. I'm just checking. Oh, language. Like I can kill him. Yeah, he's dead. But he has a lot of power, don't forget about it. I mean, 37 versus 35. Oh my god, my boy is winning. Hold up, hold up. Let him cook, let him cook, chat. And yeah, my army is like a really great deal. I just like immediately chain him and I think it's over. The Sultans, right? Yeah. Yeah, and you're, you have a lot of effective HP on your evil eyes as well. Yeah, this is uh, pretty great here. Uh, no speed for him, no elixir. I'm gonna be one-shotting these uh, sultans and I'll be pretty good to go. Okay, I think I'm doing it. This is a lot of sultans though. I don't think he's gonna one-shot them. I don't know what the position like. How many, how many sultans am I killing? 35 power, uh, 60 per power. So, so 80? Oh no, 40, yeah, yeah, 60. I'm not, I'm killing like only 20 of damage. them. Like a bit over 2,000 damage you're doing. Mm-hmm. Uh, so, like so like yeah. More, a little bit more than 20 most likely. Do you want to... I'm like actually beating him out on might as well, so that's like pretty Quite cool. A lot. But his power superior. Yeah. Oh. Boom! Now he must not lose your ghost riding for if he gets speed power that can be bad. Um yeah. I mean, if he chains these, then uh, I get to kill his ghosters with my other stuff. Okay. Uh, but he is not orbed on the chain, so that's like pretty horrible for him. Ooh, ages. That's big. Don't you just kill his ghost dragons, just chain him again and you win? No, because he still has speed prior even without these. No, you're gonna kill them. Look, you, have, you still have Medusas to shoot with. Yeah, kill, kill. I'm yeah, I'm out brawling here pretty heavily. Oh no! Like no, the dude, if you take oh he's too I do not want to go here because then the the next chain from him is uh yeah way nicer. But you you almost have lethal. You're super close. Yeah. 
He has to summon, right? I think he's yeah, I think he has to summon. Uh okay, let's see. Yeah. Oh, this is gonna be like a good chain for me. Yeah. Oh, and he missed Morales. Oh no, for him. Things motherfucker. Oh, oh my god, my boy is doing it. Oh, and Shoot. come on, boom! No, 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 he's not yet. Let's go. Pew. Let's oh go. my god, I did it. That was unexpected, dude. That was so unexpected. Oh man. That was crazy comeback. Oh my god. If he had actually, like two turns earlier, I think he'd lose it. Yeah. Yo! Oh my god, I thought I... Dude, that would've been... <laughs> That's a good good skill tree. Has like almost the elixir to you, like all the casting. Multiple air tones, by the way. Uh, no, yeah. No, 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 by one for one. Mm, kind of. You're not gonna mistake on going for devils. That minus luck could also be... Uh, yeah. I think. Uh, cheers. Dude, but look! I will go to like 1, 2, 5 and I'm gonna be raging, I think. I'm gonna be seething. Um, let's check this out. Hmm, Astigian. Yeah. I bet he got like, bit, oh, like a very big art in the volume. Yeah, okay. dude, he's like, a every game likes like this, yo. That's like, crazy. what do you mean? Insane, like, come on. Just out, so Jay chilling out here. Like, like wild. Okay, and like, look at his Utopia too. Like, he's 152 in the buy-in, but you know what his stats are like? His stats are like... Wait, That's no. not very good, actually. One to three. One to three, I mean. What's up, Disney? You come, boy? You lost. Yeah, like, this is his buy- He's not in the desert. He hasn't broken yet. This this is his stat. That's actually crazy. Wait, does he have spot casting? Uh no. Wait, does he? I mean some. He has fire magics, that's a it's from the fire town. But basic air magics though. Yeah, yeah, so this is what slowed down so much. Thank god for that. And that's what you fucking insane. Yeah, dude, but I played like a Pepega. Like shall I tell you? Like I wasted like one turn because I left my army in the ore pit. Oh my god. Uh, and I was like at the exit of the bunker, I had to DD down. <laughs> uh, then I also like went here to the library, and then I was here without any mana. Oh, I had yeah, to like just run back. Hell, yeah. yeah, dude. Oh my god. You I basically played... pulled my DD. Like, like when I DD, then I had to feed back. Dude, me. can I not? Oh my god. I need to be way, in way, way better shape tomorrow to win. Uh, yeah, but uh, the tournament will continue tomorrow, and we're going to be starting the. Um, stream at uh regular streams to uh, i mean at regular time so that's gonna be like uh 3 p.m lithuanian 12 uh 2 p.m CET. and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed bye bye ciao ciao i'll be seeing you wait we need to rain and also like you boom you don't have to rain